Hello everyone, I'm Marufa Ahmed. Welcome to my channel and this video is about Maxed Japanese Government Scholarship. So by the name you already know this scholarship is for study in Japan and this scholarship is sponsored by Japanese government. In this video I'm going to talk about what is uh, what they will provide you and what is the requirement and how do you apply for this scholarship. <music> So this scholarship basically started from April of this year but as because of the pandemic situation they extended the dates so for few countries they already uh, declared the result but still for some countries the admission application is going on so after watching this video as far <laughs> as soon as possible apply for this scholarship and my in my previous video i had talked about koch university scholarship which is located in istanbul turkey and that scholarship was for masters and phd so what about bachelor what they will do so here is this video this scholarship is for bachelor for masters as well as phd so everyone can apply for this scholarship so let me give you some information of this scholarship so they didn't mention any you know any minimum range of any minimum result or something so this is totally uh, taken on based of the merit result so they will check your academic result and also it is very helpful for you if you have any extra curriculum courses relevant to the course so that will be good for them because they also mention that um, it is uh, it is selected based on their academic record and achievements and in japan basically the undergraduate program is from four to five years and the master degree is two to three years and the phd can take three up to four years so that is the education over there and this scholarship is provided for asia europe north america latin america and caribbean middle east africa pacific so i think for all the countries whatever so the financial coverage as like the previous Koch university scholarship they will also like give you free accommodation they will give you a monthly stipend they will not take any tuition fee from you so full coverage of tuition fee so you can say it's fully funded scholarship and one thing in the previous one they didn't pay air tickets to go to their country but in this scholarship they will provide you air travel ticket from your country to japan so the ticket will be given by them which is a great help for the students let's check out the scholarship eligibility criteria so what they mentioned they mentioned that the candidate doesn't need to be uh, shouldn't be japanese nationality holder so this is for foreigners obviously and uh, another important thing and strange this is not seen at other scholarship but in this they mention that the country you are applying from the that country need to have one diplomatic relation with japan so if you don't have any diplomatic relation from your country to japan you cannot apply for this so because you will know after that how you can apply for this and why this makes sense that you need to have diplomatic relation with japan so i will tell that later so let's go furthermore and that is another uh, criteria is you someone need to be born on that date or after that is 2nd april 1985 so if someone is older than that they cannot apply for this scholarship they need to be born after 2nd april 1985 and obviously they mentioned this is funny that they mentioned that the students who are applying for master program they need to complete bachelor seriously obviously if someone is applying for masters they need to have bachelor degree then they will apply for masters isn't it but another thing i want to mention is for the doctoral candidate who is applying for doctoral degree they need to be completed at least 18 years of education and japanese language or english IELTS test is not mandatory for this uh, application procedure for this uh, maxed scholarship and now we go how to apply for this scholarship so this is simple process you i guess you don't need to pay any money so it is 
a good thing so apply as soon as possible and by the way the previous in uh, scholarship i also talk about coach university uh, scholarship university scholarship coach university is name of one university and they are providing the scholarship so in that case also you don't need to pay even one cent of money so that is full free even the no application fee you will be automatically enrolled on that university if they select you so if you want to know more about that you can check out on the i button and for this scholarship how to apply for previous one you need to knock to the university talk to the university but for this you need to go to the website of the embassy of japani in your country japanese embassy of your country so that's why you need to have one diplomatic relation with japan and your country because if you don't have diplomatic relation you don't have embassy right so as example if you are a bangladeshi student then in bangladesh there will be one japanese uh, embassy website we need to go over there and then click on the menu button in somewhere in the website you will find i will show you click on the menu button and then there will be another option which is uh, culture and education so from that culture and education you will able to see mext scholarship and then you need to apply from for that scholarship that was the eligibility criteria the provided they are giving uh, the facility they are providing and how to apply so i hope you like this video if so then please give a thumbs up and please consider subscribing my channel thanks a lot for watching this video and stay tuned <laughs> bye bye i love this